The purpose of this demo is to show how to add a Windows credential and then discover a Windows device. We will also look at the device in the Discover network and then show how to add it into the Monitor network. To add a new Windows credential, select Settings, Libraries and Credentials. From here, we can add a new Windows credential. We should give the credential a name, a domain and username. If it's a local user, we can use dot backslash for the domain. We should then set a password and confirm the password. We can then click Save and we should expect to see the credential added to our library. Now that we have added a Windows credential to our library, we can run a discovery against a Windows device that has those credentials assigned. In this example, we are going to run a discovery against the server running WhatsApp Gold. It is considered good practice to monitor the WhatsApp Gold server. To start a new discovery, select Discover and then select New Scan. We can untick Gateway IP and Local Subnet, as these options are not applicable to our scan. We can then enter the IP address of the server that we want to discover. Under the Expand options, we will uncheck Virtual, Wireless and Storage, as these are not applicable to our scan. We will not change anything in the Limit options. For credentials, the only credential we want to use will be the Windows credential previously set up. We will not change anything in the options, nor will we enable a schedule. We can now run the scan. From the discovered network, we can see the scan running. And once the scan is completed successfully, we will see the device displayed. We can see the black diamond symbol beside the device, indicating the device is not monitored. By selecting the device, we can see that the Windows credentials were successfully applied, and we can see additional information about the device underneath. We can then add the device into the monitor network, and we will see the black diamond switch to a green circle to indicate that the device is now in a monitored state. Now that we have added the device into the monitor network, we can select the device and view some additional information on the device card. We can see the overview of four performance monitors, disk, CPU, memory, and ping, and we can see the assigned credentials. If we click into device properties, we can see additional information across the top, such as OS, brand, role, etc. We can see there are five monitors assigned to this device out of the box one active monitor and four performance monitors. To see what additional information has been picked up from the device, we can look at the various reports in the Inventory tab. Thank you for taking the time to listen to this training.